As you can see by the title today, I'm reacting to Metallica in a Marassa live in Munich 2024. Now, this is the live debut of in a Marassa by the band, and uh, absolutely amazing song. One of my favorites off the uh, brand new album, and I'm so glad they're finally playing it live. So much so that I couldn't help but not react to it. I know it's not obviously pro shot yet, but uh, it's a good mix and it's a multi cam as well, so it should be decent. Absolutely crazy, you can't open a Bobby Red stamp your foot because it has such an amazing groove to it if I'm being honest. And uh, if you are enjoying this reaction video and you want to see more, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell, follow me on my social medias if you want to. The link in the description will take you to the original video if you want to check that out. And also if you would leave a like rating as I said, comment. I want to know your thoughts and opinions on this uh, song by the band. James's voice is 10 out of 10 here, it's just nailing every note, he's singing to such a high standard and obviously this is Metallica's longest song in the catalogue so that's probably why people were thinking they wouldn't play it but man they are playing it to such a high standard right now, it's so cool and uh, what an epic visual obviously you've got James and you've got the crowd behind him because it's such an amazing stage at the minute with a circle, uh, circle in the middle of the uh, stadium. can't help but not sing along because the words just get stuck in your head it's so cool hearing all the crowd singing the words as well you know i think the new album is great and it seems like it resonates with a lot of people in the crowd even and uh, it's nice to hear because you know it just shows they're still uh, writing some amazing songs you know absolutely crazy as you've got the bass the drums the guitars who are working together to create this epic unique signature metallica sound <laughs> recorded this man is so lucky to be that close to the front i mean it's just absolutely amazing obviously you've got the circle stage you've got all the screens the visuals of it it's just 10 out of 10 i was lucky enough to see metallic several times and i've been quite close like this and like the snake pit of that and it is absolutely crazy you know they're playing to such a high standard right now as always to be honest and uh, they just get better with age <laughs>
it's crazy, you know, because James's guitar tone is literally so good. Obviously, he uses fractals, and um, I believe like it's uh, a combination of diesel and uh, Mesa. I could be wrong on the ins and outs, but that's what I, I think it is. And it is just so good, man. It's it sounds as good as ever. His godlike tone is just insane. And obviously you got the tone of Kirk as well and Rob and Lars and it all just merges together, man. <laughs> And you can't have an old Bobby Rose down your foot because it's got such an amazing heavy groove to it. I love how you've got that riff that's kind of like repeated. It's so amazing. There's so many different kind of riffs within it. And, uh, you know, obviously Metallica are known for that. And obviously I'm a little bit biased because Metallica are like my favourite band. So uh, I am a little bit biased, but I love them. I love this song. Absolutely insane, man. You got another riff kind of change, which is so cool. It's uh, so nice to obviously hear them play this song finally. I'd love. I've seen them last year at download, and I was uh, hoping they played it. They never did. So, man, these fans are so lucky to see this song, obviously, in in its entirety, playing played. It's just uh, so amazing. I hope they continue to play it live. <laughs> Amazing solo that's happening right now. Kirk plays with so much passion and feel. Obviously, he's got his wire on his signature wire, and it's thrashy. It's amazing. Each note, the sustain on the guitar is 10 out of 10, as he's absolutely making Greeny scream, which is obviously a legendary guitar that he has. And it's so cool because obviously, you had James, Lars, and uh, Rob just holding it all together, and it allows Kirk to just continue shredding. <laughs> This is such an amazing part in the song, probably one of my favourite parts of it. Flows right down as you add the amazing uh, drums um, with the amazing bass guitar, just like holding it together with the crowd clapping. And you've got that riff that's coming in and it's so melodic, it's so nice. It's gone to a super chill level and that's what this song does. You know, it takes you off on the heavier start and then it slows down in the middle and works its way back up again. So cool. <laughs>
is that you've got that amazing chordy kind of uh, riffage that's happening. It's obviously not heavy because it's like super chordy, super clean. And it sounds so amazing with James's voice. It's nailing each note, which is so nice to see. What an epic visual for the people at the front row there. Obviously, they got James right in front of them. They are so lucky, man. <laughs> cool as well that amazing like i'm gonna say it's dueling guitars and it's absolutely done in such a way because it's so melodic so nice like it is uh harmonizing with each other really well obviously it's uh leading into a, a kind of another solo now but the fact that it is still chill it is absolutely insane you know and um the fact that this song is my favorite off the new album is probably because of this section <laughs> Well, obviously you got James, you got Kirk, and you got Lars in the background as well. What an epic picture that is, you know, for saying this ain't a pro shot, and uh, it isn't uh, obviously the proper audio. It's all done on the cameras and that. It sounds amazing, to be honest. Love how you got this amazing solo, so melodic, so nice, like it's well thought out, and they're just nailing it. Absolutely crazy, man. You've got all the instruments that are just nailing their parts. Such a high standard, man. And uh, I love uh, Kirk's guitar. Obviously, he has Greeny. And uh, as I said earlier, you know, that is a legend of guitar. And it sounds fantastic in this Metallica sound. I'm so glad he's using it. And um, it is uh, amazing, you know. <laughs> is so grooving like it makes you want to bob your edge damn your foot and it just makes you go nuts man so amazing there obviously you've got cool man playing to such a high standard as always the whole band are playing to such a high standard which is nice to hear the crowd as well are so loud within this mix they are singing every note shows how much they are loving the song and uh, going to be interesting to see whether they play it uh, in other sets or whether it's just one off hopefully it's not <laughs>
is absolutely fantastic. But what I want to know is, have you seen Metallica live before? I'd be interested to know where did you see them? What kind of uh, venue was it at? The set list. I want to know how they played and basically your experiences. And I also want to know if one of you was ever lucky to have been at this show seeing this right now. Because it looks absolutely insane. The stage, the uh, TV screens and the stadium. Perfect. Picked up the pace again, he got that amazing other solo, which is so cool. And if I'm being honest as well, that, that uh, is uh, James's uh, signature guitar. He's had that guitar in his catalog for years, and it's so cool. Obviously, the Red Explorer, it looks amazing, fits him well, and uh, it sounds so heavy and brutal. Look at him, he's loving it. <laughs> Absolutely sucker for a double bass, and it is absolutely being nailed by Lars. The gun like kind of uh, absolutely amazing double bass around his nail, and it you've still got that amazing melodic riff as Kirk is shredding, going absolutely nuts. You know, there's so many different solos within the songs that are different vibes, whether that be some heavy, some clean, and this is obviously super heavy again. The mix of the uh, the whole band on this is absolutely great obviously it's from the uh in-house you know all the stage and whatnot so it sounds amazing from there <laughs> enjoy this reaction video and you want to see more hit the subscribe button hit the bell follow me on my social medias if you want to but that was indeed metallica in a their live debut in munich man if you want to see the original video it's linked in the description um what an amazing song absolutely played to a high standard and uh for saying it wasn't pro shot or audio or video it was absolutely insane well done to the guy that's done this um, link in the description as I said make sure you check it out uh, if you want to comment what do you think about this band this song what your opinions in the comment section down below